And then, and then you claim it on tax. You have to reward the earnings to claim it on tax. Yeah, shout out Jesus yeah. Gooch. Okay. Hello and welcome to the Cowboy for Game Yu-Gi-Oh! podcast. I'm your host, Jake. Tonight, I'm joined by Ben from Nolan TCG. It was me first. It was, because you are on level with me. Yes. At the head of the table. Uh, to my left, we have Loza from Loza. And <laughs> uh, it's like my favourite thing when it he's is, on. It's I need so to go good. Loza from, pause, Loza. And we have Blake from Blake Ghostface. I'm always top billing as well. It's sick. I always get the last, the last, um... Save the best for last. Yep. Sure, we'll go with that. Yeah. Uh, how 15th was... <laughs> Thunder Profile coming soon. <laughs> how was our week in Yu-Gi-Oh? Um, we'll start with you, Blake. Sometimes I like this game, and sometimes it makes me want to cry. You make me want to cry. No, I do! No. A, you're fucking cracked, bro. But, <laughs> but in saying this, I actually don't have... Here's what happened. I got sacked, and I feel bad about it, <laughs> but when your opponent opens up all their side deck cards, and then side deck mining, um, it hurts. But that's the nature of the game we play. If they have it, they have it. If they don't, they don't. Sometimes they don't. Sometimes Studio Go Brag misplays and gives you the win, even though you probably didn't deserve the win. Um, <laughs> um, you absolutely deserve that win, because that deck is an abomination. <laughs> it is an abomination. What are you playing tonight? <laughs> He played um, the worst invoked list I've uh, seen. Invoked than what I was playing. Elder Lich. Uh, uh, it wasn't Elder Lich. Was it Elder Lich? It was just invoked. It, it was invoked the with smallest, like, torrential worst tribute, lineup of dogmatic nightmare. cards I've ever seen. Yeah. Yeah. So, Bragg explained it to me as invoked, but every other card you play that's not invoked is at least a one for one trade. What? It's card advantage invoked. Oh, okay. Gotcha. But um, other than that, I drew terribly tonight, but some had been okay. Um, what was your score? 2-2. Two, two. I was like, whatever. Nice. Um, and then on Saturday... I would I would like to apologise for the people that came in on Saturday and said I called them out on the podcast. That was not involving you. I promise it wasn't involving you, but it was if really anything, funny. If anything, I called them out. No, no. So these were Who like the, the new people that I was talking about, like, that come in and play the Blue Eyes and stuff, and they're, they're really lovely. But they came in, they were like, were you making fun of us on the podcast? And I went, no, 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 no. That's the other side of things, not the you guys side of things. Oh, yeah, because we would have made fun of the other people as well. Yes. Yeah, 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 so yeah, yeah. they were like, I don't I make can't... fun of anyone on this podcast. Yes. You make fun of me. Never have Joshua Glenathan. You're on the podcast. <laughs> yeah. You're still making fun, fun of about people not on the podcast. Well, yeah. Um, but I'm in like... saying that, uh, yeah, the new people are cool. Um, I should bring him out on Saturday. Yeah, I was gonna say, why don't they come any oh, other day? Oh, so so I There's got only asked. one Tuesday, I think. Yeah, but I already got asked. Um, they were like, "What should we come to Sundays or Tuesdays?" And I went, "Sundays for now until you get more, like more confident, and then more people on Tuesdays." But Sundays is fine if you've got Sunday free. Um, but yeah, they're gonna like they're doing the thing exactly the thing of it's by three ash. What about imperm? And then you're like, "Well, now you're in." Like, come on. <laughs> um, but more should all players. Oh, good. He, yeah, he didn't know what he was doing, unfortunately. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Also had a new person tonight playing Shadows. I I don't know. I didn't verse him or talk to him much. But I was like, what are you playing, man? He was like, Shadows. And I was like... Seemed like a super nice dude. Yeah, he was yeah. very nice. Yeah. In fairness, we haven't had a Shadow player for never. quite a while. <laughs> yeah, it's true. It just never happened. Yeah, no one at our locals has egregious nope. problems with Winder. Nope. No one. Actually, no, not anymore. He, no he, he literally <laughs> said to me, I was like, so what are you playing, man? He goes, Shadows. So Winder passed. And I was like, man, this guy's funny. I was like, yeah, he gets it. How was your week in Yu-Gi-Oh! Lawrence Mew? I just finally got morning. to play because I don't have uni or work for the next week. Hell yeah. <sighs> so yeah, I came to locals last Sunday as well and no one was there. And I was like, bro. <laughs> Is well, that Easter? Oh uh, no! That was the, the that was the week before. of the three v three. The week that y'all oh, went to the three v three. But I was like, that's three people. That's six people. The rest are locals. It's also people. the core of the people that come up on Sunday. Yeah, yeah, very true. So yeah, like no one came, and I was like, bro, this is one of the locals I can come to, out yeah. of four. Um, but Sorry, anyway. I was there on Easter, and literally no one was there. Yeah, James, oh, yeah. he was like, bro, where, where did Easter? Well, that's the other thing. Like... I was like, I'm, I'm not going to even go this time because I know it's not on. So I only got to come to two locals, and then I won't be at locals once again. Mm. But. Um, Last week, I'm pretty sure I did shit, and this week, I also did shit. Fair. Today, I was 1-3, I'm pretty sure. I only oh. beat the Shadol guy. Same, bro. <laughs> I think. 
Who did I verse last round? Costa? Second best on the podcast. <laughs> um, um, did you wait? Did you say you only beat Costa? No, I lost. I'm, oh, okay. I lost to Costa. I lost to Andrew. I, I also lost beat to the Costa. Shadol player. I can't remember who I versed next. Costa. I don't so, know. I can't remember my third or fourth round. But I definitely versed people. Oh no, I did beat someone. Um, I forget who. Jesse, I beat Jesse. Oh, fair. Last Same. Round. So sorry, I went two two. Yeah, I went two two. Um, but yeah, uh, I don't. I don't have much to say. I played Invoke Dark Magician. It's kind of shit. Like just slightly uh, better Dark Magician. Slightly, slightly worse, worse invoked. invoked. Yes. Um, the best interaction is Meltdown and Magician Souls is absolutely god tier. Like, you put Meltdown on the field, get Mister Alista, Magician Souls puts <laughs> Mana in the bin, and then you're like, cool. Magician Souls send Meltdown and like your other dead cards to draw. If they target it at any point, mana comes out. Summon Alistair. If they target it, Alistair, uh, mana comes out. And you just have like three bodies to make big link plays with. Mm. Um, so I really enjoy that interaction. And because you then link away Magician Souls and you link Alistair into Artemis. And you link them into Anaconda. You get to play the Invo then, make the Mecha Bar. And that Mecha is your fifth summon. So oh, so you don't get, you don't uh, get uh, Nibiru. rooted by Big Rock. And then you can activate what Anaconda. What is it? What is the free dragoon? It's a rock. It's a rock. It's an alien. It's just a, a big rock. It's a big oh. rock. Okay, fair. It's a big rock. I was making a joke. I didn't realize it was just a big rock. It's the big primal rock. being. I, w- I won't lie to you. There's like so many occasions where I don't fully <coughs> like I I've seen Yu-Gi-Oh cards, but I don't look Can't at you. Yu-Gi-Oh card. Like I don't actually look at the artwork mm. of things. It's all at Omega. all. Omega has the artworks in really high quality, really yeah. big, and I'm like, holy shit! I've never seen it like Pandemonium, for example. Yeah. The detail on that card's crazy, but I never see it because the card's tiny as shit. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I, I do that a lot more now. Like, look at, like, the artworks of cards, and I'm like, oh, I never noticed that. Does, like, Master mm-hmm. Duel show like, have you it a seen, bit better? Have you yeah, seen what Flow Under is actually? Yeah, 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 yeah they're, they're, they're little, little Yeah, yeah. they're yeah. little things. Yeah. yeah. Um, No, Flow Under is the, um, the... Never mind. <laughs> We've already made a joke. It's the boat. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's, it's the pick. No, uh... Flow Under is the boat. Yeah. Um, <laughs> <laughs> no, what did you say? It's the end. The no, birds, the, end, the, the end. birds, the end. He said. <laughs> um, how'd you go? I went one three. <laughs> I got fucking destroyed. What were you playing? Uh, I played Dragon Maid. Yeah. Day around one of us, Lewis. Uh, he opened the best possible five cards he could of both games, and I was just like, <laughs> like both games, I was okay. like, I have okay. three disruptions, and he was like, I have five extenders, and I was like. I have three disruptions. Yeah, I have uh, three disruptions. I don't care. Then I played. <coughs> what Jake, was he playing? Sword Soul. Uh, Sword Soul. Yep. Yeah. Not fair. And then I played Jake round two. Played like shit Sword game Soul. one. That then played like shit game two and was like, hmm, this sucks. Uh, round three played Marvin. Uh, he didn't get Zombie World, so I won that game. Uh, and then round four, I played Hayden, and just got fucking destroyed. Oh, was fluffle uh, things. Oh, fluffles, yeah, fluffle things. But like. When they go off, they go off, and then you cry. Yeah, it's a it, was, good deck. it was a case of me like being able to do a little, but not a lot, and then mm. just kept fucking run through. And I was like, cool. Like I was like, please don't have any hand traps in game three because I like activated my small world with Nibiru in hand, but I already had Chamber Dragon Maid, and I was like, I'm fairly sure Chamber Dragon Maid's my only target here. Looked through my deck, I was like, it is my only target here. So I binned off Chamber Dragon Maid, and then was like, oh well. Now I have two of them. So if I get hand trapped, I lose. Yep. <laughs> and then I got hand trapped, I'm lost. <laughs> I was yep. like, cool. Um, but yeah, that was that was my night. Played like shit. Uh, I played 18 hand traps and resolved the hand trap twice. Hell yeah! What the hell? Costa, yep. pl- Costa said he played 15 hand traps. He resolved three hand traps against me every game, including the ones that stopped me the most. And, I, and then played full combo. And I was like, fair, fair. I, I used the hand trap off Small World more than I used a hand trap. Nice. I normal the hand trap. Yeah? Hmm? Big effect bailer out? I don't know. I Whatever could, the shooter is. Could have done that game two against Jake to clear his board, but I didn't. What the fuck? Hand trap's bad. Mm. I'm trying to think of what... Going back, I could going back to the last week's discussion, hand one. trap's bad. Don't They're play good. it. Um, let's yeah, just true. all agree yeah. not to play it. Like, everyone. Let's, let's just, let's just mm. all not do it. And then watch combo decks just win every single game ever. No. But how was your year? Yeah. Uh, my week was good, so yeah, um, Sunday didn't happen because people have families at Easter, apparently. Sad. Um, and then... I have a job. Fair. I was the one place that was open. <laughs> yeah, true. Yeah. Oh, we were open. 
Nobody was there, but we were. Same. <laughs> yeah. Um, but yeah, tonight when X1, um, so beat your birds, um, beat your dragons, um, lost to Andrew's birds. What what um, different happened? Um, just the opening. So he just in, had it. In game three, he opened the shifter, which sure. you did. Yeah. But then he also opened equal monsters and equal back row. Oh, so uh... had M pen monster or M pen barrier statue. Yeah. Um, I think he had like a eaglin or something left over as well. And then two set and the field spell, and I had a lightning storm in hand. I was like, either way, because I know you searched the trap. Either way, this is going to resolve the same. If I destroy the monsters, you reset the board yeah. minus the statue because you can't get the mm-hmm. statue back. If I go to the trap, you're going to do all the monster things. Blah 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 blah. The main thing that was fucking me was honestly just the D shifter. Had it not been yeah. for the D shifter, yeah. everything was fine because I had a roll in hand. Nope. The droll was there as a fucking cross out target, but then shifter's like, no, no. <laughs> it's actually trolls. Surprisingly, not bad against birds, except yeah, I've really I've been drawled like once in my life. It's literally just because the D shifter D shifter yeah. insulates that whole combo with that particular hand trap. Like if you get drolled early on, that's life, it. Life hard. The really yeah. nice life thing bad. is when you play cross out with your one draw, and on your opponent's turn, you go, "I need to use every resource I have immediately so I can draw you." <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, and then what was my last game? Uh, um. Brendan no Tribergate uh, Luke oh, oh Luke sorry yeah yeah, yeah. Um, and yeah in the third game I just yeah opened the nuts um, Duster Evenly Tactics Cosmic yeah Jake um, yeah that game and two combo starters like yeah. it was still mm. super grindy because like he had the Dragon Lord bounce and I kept expecting him to use it a lot earlier than what he did and I kept like trying to bait it, and he just wasn't going for it. And I'm like, <laughs> if I try and go for the big play, he's just gonna fuck me. Yeah, so I like, had nah. to like keep trying to bait it. Eventually, I got there, but then I was like, oh, well, now I have to play like the most stupid line to get to the towers. I got there eventually, but like by that point, I'd whittled away like five minutes of my turn when there was like a minute to go, and I was like, oh, this isn't gonna work. <laughs> yeah. Um, but yeah, that yeah, I I was happy with it. I don't want to play this deck anymore. I don't yep. want to summon towers anymore. <laughs> yeah. I want to summon the purple cards. Yeah. If only we could get the structure decks in Australia. Yeah, yeah <laughs> about that. Yeah. Um, it's not the next point, but we'll bring it up now. Screw it. Um, so yeah, this will be the what like fifth or sixth day that we're supposed to have Albaz that we Absolutely. don't still know actual Gib. time as to when it's coming. Gib. Gib. Very annoying. Yeah. It's this common trend of, um, as you would know in video games, let's just not send the store uh, product early so they get it on time because then they might sell it and break street date on it. It makes no sense, however, because that's just not what stores do. Well, we'll just that, don't, don't do it. That's not the case with this. Oh, sorry. The, with, the, with like, the, set, sorry, yeah. with structured X, it's a bit different because right, yeah. there's no street date on them. Oh, there is a street um, date on structured X. Is there? Yeah, stru- structured X is definitely street dated. Huh. But also, the thing is, they're not legal it's for play like in tournaments anyway. And the like for the tournaments that matter, <laughs> if someone rocked up with a structured deck that's not legal, I'm yeah, pretty sure the like, opponent's going to go, hmm. <laughs> no. As soon as someone activates a brand new future, we'd be like, bro. That's so, a cool card. Judge! The, the issue with Australia's current supply of essentially all of Brandon is uh, it just hasn't arrived from the distro into the country yes. so like it hasn't gone from Belgium to Melbourne or whatever the fuck the, yeah, the no, distribution it, it, centre yeah. is oh. for Australian Yu-Gi-Oh uh, oh, so we're all just kind of stuck like every retailer Icon. is in the same boat because we yeah. all come from the same importer Icon and, I think ah. Yeah, Icon then splits it off to their... No, I'm not going to play my Icon's for it. Indistribu- ...distributors, yeah. and then they kind of dish it yeah. off from there. But yeah, uh, we're all essentially stuck in the same point, uh, same boat of we need the product to come into the country, and the product's on a boat somewhere. And like, realistically, <laughs> it's just on a boat. Um, Tony Abbott's like, no, structure deck yeah. out of the country. <laughs> the structure decks um, were coming, he was like, Albaz, none that's of these... a foreign name. That's a foreign name. <laughs> that's a foreign <laughs> person. To the island. <laughs> they check the manifest and it's like, <laughs> Albaz? <laughs> Branded? <laughs> what is this shit? Um, I like. He changes his name from Aluba back to Albert because Albert Al- sounds Albert. more. <laughs> that's why it goes to the past to get it. Yeah, that's why it goes to the past to land it. Yeah. Um, well, and like you could buy the Albert stuff 
online. Sure. Don't but we're going to get stuck on and, a boat yeah. somewhere. Yeah. Yeah. And then Don't you the order... Alubas we have all say the wrong thing? Yeah, they so do. Yeah. They, they all they say do. the wrong thing. Yeah. Oh, yeah, all of our so Alubas say the wrong thing. I assume guys from the past. I assume guys from the past. It'll fix that. It'll fix that. Yeah, cool. But it's not. Cool. It's still funny that they just messed it up. Like, yeah. It's so basic. Uh, Pendy Sork was the same And Pendy Sork was like I am such a fucking boomer But uh, Pendy Sork didn't specify That when it said Pop monsters on the field And draw cards And scales counted Oh Pendy Sork? Pendulum Sorcerer You don't draw cards, you add Oh sorry, sorry, sorry You add, yeah, you're correct You're correct Um But it didn't say scales It didn't say spells or monsters It just said monsters then, like, a year and a half later, it gets errated to say monst- uh, monsters and spells because it was ruled at the time. Oh, it can also pop the pen scales. Okay. And then, like, the pen scales would activate. And then that's why that's why we had the, the YCS that was 22 decks the same. Oh, sorry. Oh. 30 decks out of 32 the same. I've only mm. ever read the Euro Pen Sork and never even considered that. Yeah, it was the, the YCS where Bosch came out the week before. Yeah. We got to the event and on the mic, he, the our head judge goes... This is the way it will be ruled, and everyone went, "Yum! I've just spent two grand on this deck. You all lose now." Yeah, everyone um, was like, "Oh, my flash fire is gonna trigger." <laughs> yep, yep, exactly right. And they and then off they went. But it's the same thing of like, just print the card properly. Like, just yep. put the text. The just you're not hard. Unless you unless can't bro, fix it. just do it bro, right. Unless somebody's li- if there's somebody at Konami that literally goes. Google Translate, fucking copy, paste, put it on the card, and fucking off it goes. <laughs> hey, unless that's the process, that. like... But even then, you'd think it would be a central process, not mm. a dude in the US doing it and a dude in the UK doing it. Yes, yes. It would be a, a thing that's then sent out to everybody and goes, this is like the the, 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 the files, use these on your printer, happy days. Kind of tangentially related to this to kind of move off the topic a little bit. I thought I was allowed to use fancy words. Uh, anyway... Okay. Uh, Sorry, Jake. You so down Albaz here. We're up here. Is, you, stopped, yeah. you stopped my line. He's stealing my fancy words. <laughs> yeah. In the rest of the world, Albaz is out. Yep. It didn't really do much last weekend, did it? No. Although it uh, was an Easter we weekend. Because Lubellion is a hand trap fucking magnet. Yeah. As is Branded Fusion. Like, <laughs> okay, fair. It, to be fair, there probably wasn't that much events because it was Easter. That's So too. there probably wasn't any regionals it's or major events. Valid. Yeah, definitely don't touch it. Um, so <laughs> the other thing that I have a problem with is that everyone's gravitating towards the adventure branded variant as the best variant. But isn't a Luba expensive because you normal it? You can. Am I it? It can be special. Oh, okay, okay. Sorry. But you have to use branded opening to do that, which requires a discount. Ah, so you're going discount neutral. Comedy. Ha ha, the comedy channel. Uh, no, it is. It is comedy. Because tragedy is the one that's targeting. Okay. Um, but yeah, so I I, I've spoken with a couple of people that are planning on playing the deck and have been testing it, and we've come to the consensus that it isn't the best variant. It doesn't do enough. I feel that you'd be better off playing a more pure variant, or at least just a different variant, something right. that generates more advantage. Man, you sound a real B team, either. Well, you, yeah. you ha- no, you J- have to discard been, a lot. Jake's been exclusively <laughs> testing. The trust, trust. I've not been testing you it at all. You have to discard no. a lot. Jake's only been testing with the poor people. Yes. <laughs> with the B team. No, uh, can, I say, can I ask though, with the with the um, adventure build of it, so you've got the Griffin, the equip spell, don't ask me what it's called, and then what else does it provide in that version? Because I have not so, seen the adventure version. So the end board yeah. is effectively the... Um, what's it fucking called? The Mirror Jade. Or mirror Jade. Yeah. You've got the Mirror Jade Dragon. Yeah, I've and you've that. got um, to banish. the to... Branded in Red set. Yeah. So effectively... With mirror you've, Jade. Yeah. With You're going to like pop four... Yeah, so Chimera. banish one non-target. Pop Chimera, four, pop two. one to two... Um, and, then, and then a summon and then back, and then Griffin, plus whatever hand traps you have, and then Griffin as well. Yeah, being the yeah, only. Griffin, so like that is power. clapped, right? Like nothing's playing through, <laughs> but nothing but the big fucking bombs and shit. Like nothing but Dark Ruler and all this crap. Um, sure, but is it just that it doesn't do that as often as it needs to? Is that why? The Dark because Ruler like, doesn't do too much because. You, the Brendan summons are gets yeah. back and then you go oh right so, yeah, yeah. Is it, the board is you're summoning new stuff yeah. you're summoning yeah. new stuff yeah. right so yeah. the not... board will just be mirror jade and griffin and then you and go if they dark ruler that you're gonna fuse away with branded in red 
the Ad Lieben brings back the mirror jade. The mirror it's jade. It brings again. it back and yeah. it's new. It's fresh. It's new it again. again. Um, which is stupid. But then why? That's how it but is. Is, is, yeah, is it just yeah. not doing that forget. enough or through enough for you to say that that's the best variant? You want to play pure or play? I just don't think like if you go for a pure a purely value for money aspect of it. If you already have it, great, play it. If you don't, I don't think it's worth the six hundred dollars. Yeah. To add that in, you can right, it's definitely enough. yeah. It's not enough. Yeah. One a, one extra negate on top of all of the stuff you're already doing is like the good thing is you have the negate before you activate your brand infusion. Which, as I said, if you just pure activate brand infusion, you're playing in like every hand trap. Yeah, not necessarily on the branded, but on the Lubellian or the Albion effect. Like, and then you're locked in infusion if brand is resolved. Mm. So if you're not a fusion based build, hey, you're passing. Yeah. Yeah, I just I don't think that it's worth it. And within the deck, there's definitely things you can play to play around that, and other cards that you may already have that can do a similar job. So cross out. You're not playing into hand traps if you negate them. Um, the structure deck comes with a continuous card that they can't negate the activation of your cards that fusion summon, and they cannot respond on the fusion summon. So if you resolve the branded while that's up, your Albion is still going to be able to do its thing. Plus, the continuous get you a search for a hand trap. It's hmm. meltdown. So, Jake's just yeah. trying to reason with you as to why he can play, so play meltdown still. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's just it's, it's got just something. Meltdown. Yeah, okay. Okay. it's, it's their own meltdown. Down. It's okay. reverse meltdown in that yeah. you get the search after you summon as opposed to you get the search to do the summon. Yeah, yeah. that's interesting. So I think. Um, do we have any uh, like big enough events coming up that we'll see like a couple? Well, of I haven't seen any something? other YCSs announced at this point, so there'll uh, be a bunch of regionals and stuff. One in a few. Oh no, there was one, but it got cancelled again. Okay. And do we ever get... Oh, oh uh, also... not People, I for some reason, again, just because I'm at Good Games a lot, are getting asked more and more about the podcast. Which is cool! If you have any questions, uh, and you see any of us, feel free to ask or comment, uh, ask questions. Um, but they were asking if we ever got confirmation on um, the uh, YCS jail that people got locked in for not eating I hadn't heard anything oh I'd someone seen. did comment on the last did video they? Uh, did you hear about this oh, okay. no. about the, the... so at the YCS that we had not last week the week before they weren't allowed to eat weren't allowed to drink weren't allowed to leave the venue yep. weren't, and like people were saying they got to top 8 and they were like shaking it was like, Ralph Nevin yeah, yeah. What the uh, hell? someone commented saying they were there and apparently the bathrooms were a fucking disaster that's yeah. crazy yeah. I it was can't the only place imagine... where you were allowed to actually do anything yeah so the bathrooms so were just weird. like fucking I, was, I said to Ben, I was like, that's just super illegal, right? Yeah. Like, that's How can super they do that? illegal. That's creepy Because it's your choice to be there. If you don't want to, if you don't follow those rules, just leave. Wow. But then I think that, I think that, um, falls on the level. If like, they're going to do that, they should announce it. Yeah, that so evolved, that, 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 that does crap. just land on Konami US, I think. Well, you weren't allowed to remove your mask full stop. Yeah. Oh, so if you could in the venue, in the you venue. could not remove your mask full stop. So people just didn't eat all day. Yep. Or drink. Didn't eat, didn't drink all day. Oh, a bathroom, I guess, but that was it. I understand they need to wear masks because uh, and the comments, it, like, the wow. comment that we got was in relation to the bathrooms, in that they were disgusting. Yeah, the bathrooms were as disaster. they always yeah. are because, like, the it's majority of honestly, players honestly, thousand people, just and a thousand people, thousand people not giving a shit. Like, Find the one that's furthest away and also has a disabled sticker on it. That's what I did at Wasia yeah. City, the first one. <laughs> yeah, or just go to the women's is, bathroom. It's got to yeah. be empty. That's it's what like, I say. Use the super, yeah, it's super disappointing. Guys keep committing crimes here. Yeah. It's just very disappointing because Konami, like, sorry, not big Konami, Konami US, which is who organizes those events, provides the streams, all this shit. They know that going in, they organize it a long time in advance about like what regulations they have to follow. They knew this was going to be a thing they should have told people. They absolutely should have told people because they're, they, you don't ever want to put people in that position, but. Well, Hopefully we'll see the Anyone difference. with a slight medical condition... I was just about just to fucked. say, you're, like, you're, you're putting fucked. yourself in such a liable position if someone with a medical issue falls into problems. Especially Ooh, yeah. in the US. The laws in the US regarding <laughs> being on even on private property and you endangering yourself, you can still be in a fucking world of hurt. But not that any of us, not that any player would just have the money to be able to just go. <laughs> but, you know. So yeah. we move to the rest of the news. Yes. yes. Fuck um, that. Change it. Fix so, your shit. Um, brief check in on Master Duel. Anyone doing anything? The no. Synchro event's still going. Synchro event. I saw, is I all right. Synchro event. It's cool. 
I wish it's... people wouldn't play True Draco. But... Oh, that, that's probably the worst thing about it. Is like <laughs> didn't they say... ban? Didn't they ban enough stuff? That You'd they... think so. No, like there's so many different cancer <sighs> variants, and the problem is that they never hit enough of them for it yeah, to actually do. They a try. Thing. They do try, but there's just like too they much hit, cancer. Um, they banned Guru, so that you couldn't do Guru Diddy control. Dynamite? They banned Multi Faker, so you couldn't do Ulti guys bullshit. Um, they banned a bunch of cards that were like barrier stun control, mm -hmm. but that wasn't enough. Um, and then yeah, Draco is still at full they power. They didn't touch true Draco, so naturally. Masterpiece Lel. Well, Masterpiece banned in general. It's so. not that, but they don't need it. No, they don't. Yeah. The the funny thing was, I was versing a uh, Draco player the other night. Um, he did a thing that didn't do much. Um, I stole his level six and then used my level four to make a Baron. <laughs> <laughs> That's yeah, nice, That's nice, good. very That's nice, fun. very cute. Yeah. Um, but yeah, like I, I was really annoyed because I, <laughs> I mentioned on the last podcast I built Speed Road Wind Witch, played like six matches, lost all of them convincingly. Because you said Speed Road. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. And then yeah. it turned out that I could just do better with my fucking Metaphys deck. Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. Metaphys. I, I, it's so weird. I associate you so heavily with the Wind Witch stuff because you were somebody. What deck did you play where you were somebody Invoked Wind Witch invoked? <laughs> no, no, no. I don't think so. I think this was before about what were you something crystal wing it? They came out like a week ago. Win It's definitely the same. It's absolutely Win Witch Invoke. It's that deck. What were you it was Crystal Raijin, Wing that Win Witch Invoke. Raijin summoned, and right? Crystal Wing yeah. pass. Yeah. What were Indestructible you Crystal what, Wing what, what, Raijin. Was, what was summoning Crystal Wing before that? It was Monarchs, right? With Zulkin? Oh, I played like a Red Dragon game. Turbo deck. That, like, yeah, oh. that must be what I remember. So about. I just like yeah. Turbo two sixes, a tuna non tuna, Zulkin yeah. set one, make yes. thing O, make abyss. Yes, and like that was that was my play, but that deck was fucking awful. Because I remember, <laughs> fun, I remember when bad. Zulkin dropped, and people were just doing everything and anything they could to get this fucking Zulkin out, just so they could set make Cheat a crystal, out a dragon. make a crystal part. wing, and everyone was like, just "Make a crystal wing, yeah. bro!" Just the worst part is you thing. get to Zulkin, and then you don't have the set, and you're like. Bruh. That's the thing. The amount of times I tried to luck sack my way into it by like yeah. um, making Coral Dragon <coughs> and then using Coral Dragon to make Zulkin. I'm like, Zulkin draw? Sack hard! <laughs> Let's go! Let's fucking go! But yes. <laughs> um, but other than that, no updates, no new stuff, no fucking nothing Shit I Shit still. About. Yeah. We need a ban list, um, we need new cards. Yeah, yeah, so the Synchro event ends in three days, so... Are we through all the cards? Are we through all the events? No, fusion no. festivals? Ah, oh, of course. Normal summon Alistar. Yeah, except yeah. I can't link into shit to That'll get Oh, yeah. Too. I'll watch Alistar get limited. For yeah. Fucking. Well, they limited Meltdown in the, the, the premier fusion deck for the Did last they? four in years. The, in, in, the, years in the rare limited. thing. Limited. In the rare, in the commons and rares, they were like, Meltdown is at two, and it's like. Oh, no, Meltdown's already, already at two. two. Oh, it's, oh, sorry, it's already at two. There you go. Yeah. Well, that's why it was at two. <laughs> <laughs> the let's put it there. Um, so, on to some product news. We have the full set release. Well, not the full. There's some card missing, but most of the oh, set no, release. No, the whole set is there now. You go back and check it again. Yeah, the whole set's there. Fuck. Why? Jake took screenshots to be like, it. "I've got this." Well, I didn't know there's it'd like been updated. You fuck. I can show uh, it to you. It's, if it's quick. You sneaky schmuck. Because I now used we, it in a dark magician video. <laughs> Here it is. If you want it quick, okay. the pages yes. aren't in order. But when does this come that's out? Okay. okay. P-O-T-E is... I've also um, circled stuff. Fucking long time away. Ignore this it. is okay. okay. Um, so, the main highlights of this is that they've reprinted a heap of the um, Despia stuff. Pretty yeah. much oh. anything but oh, branded on. opening and um, the Harlequin Dragon that burns for 600. Um, <laughs> when did you get that? Where's the that's oh, already so up. this is oh. the whole... Can I do one throw it here? Um, so this is the whole ghost from the past. Chronicle Magician, baby. That's I don't everything. know why they gave it to us so quick. Oh wait, 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 yeah, wait. We know Confirmation. The, art for the, Cyber the Cyber Dragon is the original art. This is also a question I got asked. OGR, baby. Um, it's did you the also OGR. scream at them when they asked? You? No, no, no. <laughs> they, they, however, they did laugh you very much. Tell from that picture. It was yeah. clearly the original yes. art. They thought it was quite a humorous line of thing, but uh, oh, Didi, Didi, Didi. Sandwich Didi. got it's a reprint, fucking, fellas. That Sandwich. Copernicus is the only thing in there that was worth anything. Um, so Didi, these, yep, yeah, cool. Uh, oh, Brave? It's Brave. Oh, prank? Is that what that is? 
No, I don't know. Plunder Patrol. That's Plunder Patrol. He's looking at Plunder, Plunder Patrol. Patrol. They're so both gave small the dude dudes. Who admitted not 10 minutes ago that he sees cards but doesn't actually absorb them. <laughs> They're any both of them, small and dudes. And he's going to go like, oh yeah, this is a deck. Oh, Jake gets his fucking balls and shit. Hey, did 10 year reprints are random? Like, yeah, so they've have... reprinted a heap of the agent stuff, which is good because mine was scuffed. Yeah. Yep. So Jake got his wish, gets all of his stuff. The uh, new right. agent we stuff have... too, right? That's in there. Yeah. Uh, new yep. agent stuff as well. We get a bunch of imports. Uh, we see like. Uh, <laughs> What we get, like the DDD stuff, like it's clear. We got Heat Soul. We got sure. uh, the Big Boral Dragon, all that kind of stuff. Uh, the new Gamer. Rainbow Dragon, I guess. Zenith Crystal Beast, yeah. Zenith Crystal Beast. I love Beast. it. I love uh, it. Lawsa gets his wonderful card that he mentioned earlier. His Chronicle rank four Chronicle Turbo Magician. deck. No, we also there. get Chronicle Magician. Yes. Oh, Chronicle. it's terrible, right? Yep. Nah, put it in your deck. New new deck profile. Go and check it and out. And Chronicle is uh, the Blue Eyes Dark it's Magician. It's the Blue crossover. Eyes Dark Magician crossover. Yeah. I don't know how his Chronicle uh, Magician deck profile will go, considering the last video he mentioned it in had brackets after its name trash. trash. <laughs> <laughs> I won't lie to you. The amount of stupid shit I know because of your videos, I but my brain would not be taken up by the fact that I know this card is coming out and that it is a fusion of Blue Eyes and Dark Magician. I don't I need wish to it know was this a card. Fusion. I hope we get a fusion eventually. Yeah. We get new Dino cars. Yeah, what, you, yeah. The dino there's three cars. dino cars. Yeah, there's so, dino cars. We well, just you should got... know this because it's a GX like iteration. The character, um, Dino the, DNA, with the dude. crocodile. Oh, yeah. with the crocodile. No, it's the crocodile. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are they not the same person? No, no, They're not. No, they fight yeah. each other. Though. They yeah. fight each other. So they Jim get their is beast the one yeah. who's Isn't that because the fusion. crocodile wants to crocodile um, screw the dino DNA dude? Yeah, the crocodile's trying to fuck. Yeah. We get Brute Enforcer, Link to surprisingly good and pops it's up it's actually in a not bad OCG is this lists. where we get heat soul is that heat soul uh, yeah, heat yeah, soul. yeah heat soul's in here that's a cool just draw draw one just link three pay draw a thousand, one. Pay draw, a thousand one. draw one yeah. I like um, it we get new great rank four. Oh yeah we do <laughs> josh is not gonna play that they've had a card to let them quick exes for ages and it's still not relevant <laughs> yeah <laughs> true. sometimes konami can like try and try and try and you're like no i'm it's, good no, they I'm also not. have a ritual monster we get <laughs> so many <laughs> we all get new so do you Hmm? What yeah. are you summoning it? I'm not summoning mine. At least mine's Rota. We all get new cock. Uh, cool. Cock, cock, yeah. cock Ram's in here. Uh, really, really good card. Oh, that I is like a cock. good card. I remember yeah. that being busted. Yeah, Cock Ram is mm, very cock is good. good. Do pick that up. Um, then we got, yeah, a fuckload of imports. A lot of them, like, kind of randomly pointless. Like, the zombie stuff's good. The zombie stuff was expensive. Stuck in a structure deck. Good mm. reprint. Yep. Uh, Colt Wing, though, we got it in gold. It's yeah. like 10 cents. It's also uh, Deskbot. Like, uh, it's yeah, like, here's Hulk squad. <laughs> I guess it's foil. Hulk is in the set too, so um, maybe that's why. Middle fiber. Oh, that's true. Yeah, it's yeah. effectively Hulk, giving people. Hulk. It's giving people Hulk shit. Nice. Uh, Bloza, you get Dark Magician, the Dragon Knight. Again. Yeah, baby. Uh, oh, Math Mech. Can you um, play one? Sigma? Yeah, if yep. any. All yeah. the Math Mechs got I have reprinted. like seven. All of them. Yeah. Yep. Oh, that's so fucking good. Um, I so needed Ghost. Oh, yeah, I, I need ghost. Final Sogma. Yeah. Ghost, <laughs> ghost Eye of Tamias, I bro. can beat Flunder finally, bitch. We'll get to, we'll get to the Ghost Rares oh, so yeah, that sure. Loza can go on his rant. Yeah, baby. Better set that up for the end. Uh, we see a Riser reprint. Good reprint. Very good reprint. Uh, oh, yeah. It was, the one, it was the one thing that people were like, Flunder isn't a budget deck. And I'm like, yes, it is. And they're like, but Riser. And I'm like, no, I don't care. Yeah. It's fifty yeah. bucks, but no. Exactly. Now, now this that that should be an ultra that will taco in three days. So it'll be a, a yeah. four dollar card. Um, we see Galaxy Soldier get its third ultra rare reprint. Hopefully, nice. that should like finally kill the value all of all these ultras. cards. Gonna look like this in <coughs> two days. Bro. Oh yeah, definitely. Yeah. Especially because people are gonna open fuckloads of it, and then it's gonna let it sit there. Yeah. Sit on the table. Um, yeah. It's only Soul Dragon players who care about it. Who cares? A True. bunch of the vanilla kind of super uh, vanilla fusions. That we kind of oh, just randomly need, really? need, need reprints. Oh yeah, like um, fusionist. Fusionist and shit. Um, oh my god. Sandwich. Sandwich. I think is Seamus or Theseus getting reprinted in this? Uh, it is not getting reprinted. That would have been a. Card. You mean the best card? The best card of 2017. It was the best card of 2017. Um, I was watching a replay on Master Duel, someone playing um, that. They summoned that, and then the opponent just scooped, and he's like, "This really is the best card." <laughs> <of 2017>. <laughs> <laughs> um, other notable fusions, Cyber Dragon stuff, it all kind of randomly mm. needed reprints. Um, for Synchros, we got Final Sigma, uh, Yazi, yes. good reprint. Uh, oh, Cupid Pitch gets a foil reprint three Ooh, months after sure. it came out. That's, That's good, fine. It's a good um, card. For the X Seasers, uh, we see Dragoobleon, huge reprint, card desperately needed to be done. I like that. Uh, card. Random stuff like Dugaris, we mentioned it before, but the, the Math Mech, oh, so Alan yes, Bershon yes. getting reprint. Yep. Uh, Skycab Centuria, like oh, Ray, 100%. Ray uh, 100% necessary, needed. That card was 
really expensive yeah, it was close so than dumb. a reason other than it makes a Zeus. <laughs> uh, makes it makes a Zeus and wasn't printed. Yeah. So yeah. yeah. Halk, as we get for Lynx, Halk, of course, good reprint on Halk. Mm. Um, is that it for the Lynx? Just I Halk and so. Vampire Sucker? Yeah. Sure. 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 <laughs> okay. Well, there's Heat Soul as well. Um, oh, yeah. Well, oh, well, that's, yeah, that's, that's the, import. the import stuff. It's, it's so good, though. Uh, Faris, Vision Hero stuff. Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. All, yeah, gets yeah. That All of us. Really expensive. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, I mean, Faris is the, the first one, Faris. which I don't care about. It's, it's increased that you want to negate. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Faris is the pink one. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, me and Jake yeah. own own Faris's like, together, and I sold them King. the day before this reprint got announced. Oh, you said this. Kings. Yeah. Kings. Uh, I players. had a feeling it was going to be in here, and I was like, I need to sell this now before the leaks happen. So yeah. yeah. next day, leaks happen. You are big brain, so. Yeah. Um, all of the tenies, all getting supers. So random. Sure. Yeah, nice. They were all common, um, so like. They have supers already, though. Yeah, oh, I think it's the, the shooter and the earth. Oh, one the good ones. The yeah. yeah, the shooter is the no. Sorry, uh, we see Mardell. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. Mar Mardell getting a reprint. Uh, that's kind of a card that I'll just pick up because I saw oh. the high rarity stuff. Oh shit, Lamy is getting reprint yep. too. God yeah, damn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. Yeah, it's, 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 is this Lamy is only hollow? No, it's super in the originally super. Yeah. Oh, yep. Ghost of the is one of the structure for everything. Everything's super. I get the taco thing now. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Everything um, in the set. But then, it's gonna look. Uh, they can't mm. print. All the ultra sets just are so bad. We then get to the spells. Uh, Flute of Summoning Karibo. Hell yeah! Woo! Needed a reprint. Yeah! Lachlan bitched in the cowboy chat saying it was a terrible reprint. It needed a reprint. Uh, it was like cool. a $20 common. Really? Yeah. yeah. Wow. Yeah. For Karibo players. Yeah. Uh, zombie World, random sure. kind of stuff. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, a bunch of just kind of. Pointless random mm. vampire. Oh, advanced related. ritual. Is that advanced ritual? The summon? generator field spell is really good. Generator field spell oh, yeah. is a good reprint. Yeah. Um. Pretty much that deck's budget now. Fossil like fusion. Because they gave you the new contract. Fusions. Ultra contract. But they didn't reprint the fossil cards that were actually expensive. Oh, <laughs> like well, that's that, a that one fusion that was expensive. Yeah. Oh, the Entus. The trap. Oh, that's the Yangzing trap. Yeah. Oh, the Yangzing pillar. Nine pillars of vampire domination. Counter. Why are some of them highlighted yellow? Because uh, I used them for a video. Didn't. No, I think. Okay, sure. Oh, no. No, no I used them okay. for a video, so I highlighted stuff. Okay. Oh. I assume at first it looked like the ones that we didn't know about. And oh, no, like, I just highlighted my shit. Uh, that then does bring us to the ghosts. They were all confirmed. Uh, we did receive confirmation. Eye of Tomias is real. Take it's the floor, real. Also. And it's been eroded. No, it hasn't. It's shit. It's terrible. It's still oh, the same. It's oh, just. Ah, 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 kilo de. Um, uh, <laughs> Uh, do we have a ruling for, for uh, do we have a ruling for branded? Yeah, it seems to just be acknowledged that we're just going to play by the fact that you yep. can use it for you, grave. You can just cool. use you can play the light. fusion substitutes. Yep. Okay. Just use Have them. fun. Yeah. Dragoon. Just use A lot them. of dragoons. No. Big YouTubers <laughs> no, are like, it works this way. So people just seem to just be accepting I mean, it, it works this way. It does. So, Alright, let's like, do it. I I'm not to side with big YouTubers because, as we know, a lot of them are fucking cucks. We're going to get to um, worlds and people Play three circles. Yeah. Remember, remember, kids, on World's Day, it's ruled the OCG way, so yep. don't show up to your World's Day tournament oh, and be I like, imagine. time to play. Although, no, there's no World's this year. No World's oh, this yeah. year. Never mind. Sad. Sorry, moment the deck will be fucking silence. slaughtered by 2023. Of silence, <laughs> have some compassion. Have Moving on. Um, so, we have some more announcements from uh, Power of the Elements. Uh, there's a lot. Is Power um, of the Elements the next main set? I've asked one this. After. Oh, wait, what's the next main set called? I uh, can't remember. Yeah, neither can I. I feel like we've only no, no, talked no, about Power of the Elements. It's called Can't Remember. Fair. Yeah. Yeah. Good. It's spelled with a K, though. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> where? In the, at the start In of the Remember? remember. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, we're not funny. <laughs> um, okay, so uh, we start with um, some Melf. Melfi cards. Uh, so like we Melf. start with Melfi Wallaby. Um, <laughs> Earth... It's a Wallaby, mate. <laughs> Uh, yeah, hops Earth, around on two legs. <laughs> Earth beast effect level two zero attack four hundred defense. Oh, uh, you can doing? use the first and second once per turn. If your opponent normal special summons a monster, all this card is targeted for an attack by opponent's monster. Return this card to your hand, then you can special summon two Melfi monsters, each with different names from each other from your deck, except for Melfi Wallaby. One of the better Melfi. Uh, during the end phase, you can special summon this card from your hand. Um, then we've got uh, Melfi Seal, yes. water beast tuna effect. Uh, Yo, wait, it's a fish. Yeah, they, they made a Melfi that is a fish. But how's it going to be in the forest? Aquatic Melfi. Uh, to reiterate, we are not funny. <laughs> Why is he in the, the Bro, group? Bro, do you know how big tuners are? 
You can only use the first and second effect of this card's name each once per turn. If a face-up beast, monster, or monsters you control other than <coughs> Melfi Seal was returned to the hand this turn, quick effect, you can special summon this card from your hand. Hey, then immediately after this effect resolves, Synchro Summon using only this card and Melfi monsters in your hand as material. That's actually pretty good. So quick effect to summon and sync Sync immediately. Sync to what? So it's a... Uh, the Melfi Synchro. Which it's in archetype. Yeah. Is it a Baron? Version? Yes. No. I don't care. But they just and play a copy of the squadron as well. It does and some negate, Tatsunoke. and then it floats into an Exe. Because okay. it doesn't have to use monsters on board. As he's about to say. And the Exe mm-hmm. pops too. Um, and then during the end phase, so if this card is in your graveyard, target a beast Exe, you control, attach this card to it as material. So you um, attach to the Exe as well, the seal. Uh, then we have the Synchro, yes. Cheerful Melfi's Elf, Earth-based Synchro, level 4, 1500 attack, 1000 defense. Uh, generic materials. You can only use the first and second effects of this card's name each once per turn. Sure. If this card is special summoned, you can target a face up monster on the field, return to the hand. So not synchro summoned. Correct. Yes. Only special so summoned. So once it's engraved, because the Melfi's all like just bounce with each other, they can do it. Man needs to fix his fan build. <laughs> Are you then, good? I don't know if it's throwing up, but someone like three blocks down the road's fan build slipping. <laughs> Uh, during, uh, if your opponent normal special summons a monster, or this card is targeted for an attack by an opponent's monster, return this card to the extra deck, then you can special summon one Melfi's Xe monster from your extra deck. Look, they gave him a lot of support. And then you do the Xe? Yep. Things. And then it's finally we have a spell, good. uh, Melfi's Staring what Contest. Finally? What's the Xe do? Well, they're already out. You There's a couple it. different ones. You have to read it. Um, but yeah, they, they, they also okay. bounce to do things. They bounce and pop. Um... So, so really continuous spell, beastie. you can only use the first effect of this card's name each once per turn. You can reveal one beast monster in your hand, add from your deck to your gra- or graveyard to your hand a Melfi monster with a different name to the reveal monster, and if you do, place a reveal monster on the bottom of your deck. At the start of your opponent's battle phase, activate this effect, Any number of, reveal any number of Melfi monsters in your hand, um, and then your opponent's monsters lose attack equal to the combined attack and defense of all monsters currently revealed by this effect. Um, which Jesus is not, Christ, we need keywords. It's not amazing because all of the Melfi's are weak. super Shut low up. attack. They're very weak. So much That's probably the worst part of the support, but it's magic the best mouth. artwork. I don't want it to be the magic. The artwork for the magic. continuous spell is just like really up close Melfi Rabbit. Yeah, it's, yeah, true. Yeah, it's yeah. just like... Yeah. It's a really good artwork for a really bad color. Yeah, like being able to cycle is kind of good, but mm. the battle phase effect is like a... Yeah, it just... Things that happen in the battle phase are always kind of... I feel like it needs to be Unless their name's evenly matched. I can't believe you said that in the presence of a Dragon Maid player. Dude, if you think there is any world I know what Dragon Maid do, you are mistaken. I just learned what Salad did. <laughs> at, if you start battle phase, you go plus three. Oh, see, that doesn't actually seem bad because no, it doesn't rely on Dragon attacking. Maid battle phase is actually scary. Like, okay. Actually. Yeah, going to battle phase. Do you lose to Mirror Force? No. no. Okay, then you're fine. God, nobody you loses fine. to Mirror Force. Against, yeah, uh, they do. Against, I was no, playing he plays around it. Duck once, and he didn't know he didn't have to enter the battle phase. And yeah, I was like, you can just. Oh, you off. lost. <laughs> you you yeah. can just go. On. Yeah. He's like, no, I have to go through. Like, I, like, I have to. <laughs> I did the negates and I did the bounces, and I still had like I would then gone into like the other dragon maids after you do the shift, and I had like three defense mode dragon maids. He's like, oh, I guess battle phase, and I'm like, start a battle phase. He had nothing on board. I'm like. What are you doing? Start a battle phase, go massively plus, and then end a battle phase, go plus again. And then like, he, oh. at the end of the duel, I was like, why the fuck did you end the battle phase? Like, you have to. And I was like, <laughs> no. no you don't. Lesson Whoa. learned. You do not have to, but if your opponent has nothing on board and says entering battle phase, you might want to be a bit worried. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's uh, okay. Pull back to the end. It's fine. Man, sure. <laughs> Next, we have um, the next Albaz support because oh, yeah. we needed some. Also fun, this <laughs> Uh, so the first is Albaz of the Ashes, uh, cool. level 4 Dark Dragon Effect Monster. You can use this third effect of this card's name each once per turn. This card is treated as Fallen of Albaz while on the field of Graveyard. Sure. If there is a level A fusion monster in your graveyard, this card gains 200 attack for each monster in your graveyard. Sure. Also, other monsters you control cannot be targeted by your opponent's effects. Uh, yeah, if a monster you good. control leaves the field during your opponent, uh, due to your opponent's effects while this card and a fusion monster are in your graveyard, special summon this card. Not amazing. Sure. Oh, I thought you were going to say been, something else. That should was have been shit. Albaz in the deck. Yeah, yeah. Putting it out there. Yeah. No. That, would be, that would be yes. okay, but not great. Follow of Albaz in no, deck. but it's full of Albaz Ab- in deck. You can't play Albaz. Exactly. <laughs> Why do you want to play Albaz? Super poly when you normal summon it. Um, but then they got a, quite a good trap. Um, branded separation. Um, tribute one fusion monster. What then type target of trap two. Is it, sorry? 
Normal trap. Just a normal trap? Sure. Yeah. Uh, tribute of fusion monster, then target two monsters among either graveyard uh, or that are banished, except for fusion monsters. Special summon one of those monsters on each side of the field, or if you tributed a fusion monster that mentions Fallen of Albaz as material, you can special summon both of those monsters to your field in face up defense <laughs> instead. That's not bad. Face up defense good. instead. Yeah, so it's not a battle phase thingy, but like no, being able to fuck, special. Fuck battle phase. Like if your opponent's got something banished that you're yeah. like. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Or if you've so, banished something that you're. Yeah. All the like fusions for fucking. Albaz have like low defense. No, some of them are okay. Okay. Titanic Glide's like 28. Okay. Plus you have to summon non fusions. Oh, it's non fusion. Oh, yeah. so it's, it's you Albaz tribute a good. fusion and then you it's have Albaz, to summon. It's, it's, I, that's what I thought of it as. I didn't yeah. think it was yeah. an aggressive tool. You tribute fusion and then you have but to bring just, back. It's non-fusions. just two non fusions. Yeah, so two even non-fusions. if you've got like wait synchros. No, no, wait, 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 wait. Albaz fallen of Albaz triggers on special summon. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So you just fusion summoning. This card is just a fusion summon. Yes. True. Very true. You literally wait. just giving your opponent one material. Wait, fallen. No, you don't. You if you tribute, you yeah. So you summon back your fallen of Albaz. No, I'm saying you don't have to give your opponent shit. The thing you summon back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you yes. just, it's just a fusion spell. Okay, that's cool. That's it's a though. two-step fusion spell. Fusion trap. Yeah, it's, sure. it's a fusion spell that puts your Albaz trap back in graveyard. Yeah, fuse on the later. opponent's turn. Fuse yeah. on opponent's turn. Very true. But you then have to discard so, two. Not right? bad. Yeah. Just one. So much. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, next, we have an announcement. Well, this one isn't from um, the right set. Um, so hey, no, 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 we're still covering that. Remember, we agreed to cover that card. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was just going to do them in order. Why did we have to fun. agree? Is it a bad card? Um, I don't know what this set's called, but it's like the um, five days. It'd be a selections pack or something. It'd be our brother's a legend. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so this is Power Tool Braver Dragon. Don't say brave when you mean racist. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, is it a racist card? <laughs> Power Tool Racist Dragon. Is it? <laughs> is it, it says like Braver? Braver. Oh, what no. the hell is Braver? More brave. <laughs> <laughs> Although I don't, I don't think braver is a word, is it? That's what I mean. No, <laughs> I'm That's braver I'm than you. Any Stop throwing bottles. Uh, Earth Machine Synchro Effect Level Nine Two Five Two Three. Uh, generic materials. You can only use these cards in first and second effects each once per turn. I'm out. Clearly, does not want to hear about the braver dragon. No. <laughs> um. If this card is special summon, you can equip up to three equip spells with different names from your deck and or graveyard to this card. During your main phase quick effect, send one of your equip spells equipped to this card to the graveyard and target an effect monster on the field. Either change its battle position or negate its effects until the end of the turn. So, quite good in Infinite Wolf, except I am yet to see a way for them to summon it. Yeah, being yeah. level 9 makes it kind of awkward. I think they get there because they used to make VFDs. Oh, wait, so no, their like, whole, yeah, their, their yeah. boss is level 9. Yeah, so yeah they, their whole thing's level, level 9. So, yeah, but would you go for their actual in archetypal thing or would you yeah, go for this thing that's what I'm worrying, wondering well I think you just go for this because it's the same thing it's literally the same thing but the other one doesn't on. negate the, it just pops yeah this it's just the same thing that gates instead wait this thing yeah. negates wait don't you just equip like the fucking one yeah, that can't do shit I've read it too yeah, right? that, read, that card is egregious I hate that card yeah. which one? Um, um, in some like old ass equip card it's like while this card is equipped your opponent cannot target anything except for this no. Oh yeah, it's a really old uh, chainmail. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, and then they have another equip spell that's like, this card cannot be targeted. <laughs> Sick. It, it just locks them out of targeting effects, so like yeah. you kind of activate Infinite monster Wolf. reborn because it targets a card. The great god. I still get so many comments like, also you can't monster reborn dragoon in grave. It can't be targeted, and I'm like, <sighs> I get that comment. I want to say once every week at least, <laughs> at least. I'm just like, bruh. Because I like to You should just water. have, like, a pinned video to the top of your channel. It'll be like, stupid dumb questions, stupid questions answered yeah, by Loza. Yeah, Dragoon FAQs with Loza. Granted, you'd be cutting your interactions it on began. your videos down by at least 90%. <laughs> <That's> true. <laughs> Very true. Um, speaking of non-targeting removal, um, oh. dragons needed some more support, um, so let's give them yep. that. Oh yeah, that's um, We have Grand Ground Tusk Dragon, Is level 8 brave? earth dragon effect. Uh, attack 14, defense 24. Uh, you can only use this card's effect once per turn. If this card is normal special summon, you can target up to two other cards on the field. I take it back, apparently it is targeting. Um, oh, that's alright. Uh, destroy those cards, and if you do, this card gains 600 attack for each card destroyed. But it doesn't have a way to special summon itself. Definitely Doesn't not it? Heavenly mm. Spheres. Yeah, there's no Link 2 that summons it from deck for free, right? Yeah. Well, you just summon better cards. You can summon Floodgates off that card. You don't need to pop two. You can pop Scythe. You can Dagda set Scythe and then pop Scythe. 
Oh, and one of their cards. Do you just make DP instead? I guess, but they don't typically play DP. Can right? they could, but this is like an in archetype way to do it. Yeah, I feel That's... like in a like out and out dragon deck, this is a very good choice of card to summon. Plus, yeah. Anaconda can get negate. I mean, Fusion Destiny probably wouldn't, but I feel like there's just are more unfair cards you could summon off. Heretic seal than this. They just yeah. don't. No though. one does. Like, yeah, they no just one don't. summons yeah. sloth anymore. Everyone's summoning King one of Dragon Mage to search a tidying for next turn. Yeah, that's right. One person summons sloth against sloth me. I'm just like, can you do I'm that? He's like, yeah. I'm like, yeah. The, no one the, does it on my Yeah. Oh, shit. Well, they sloth, used to do that. They oh, used to do that cool. a lot. They used to summon Goliath. sloth and Goliath. Goliath. You can do Hell yeah, that's fine. Oh, you can do either. I mean, it's cancer either or either. But... Both of them. Are Someone got Goliath to me, and I'm like, I haven't seen this since Blue Eyes. Like turboed it off that. that yeah, yeah. Four yeah. K rank, rank, rank eight. Nine. It's yeah. like a rank nine. Yeah, mm. that's now banned. And yeah. I was like, Dark Battle. Dark yeah. Battle. Yeah, yeah, Dark Battle. It got banned because it won a YCS in Japan. That's it. it, it I remember just getting FDK. banned and Andrew being like, what? Because <laughs> they have a different text. On, oh, that's another card. Oh, they have a different text? text? Uh, Gandor X in the OCG has different text. Oh, yeah, like, that card's just, broken over there. It burns there. for current attack, not original attack. Oh, yeah. So, you so just... Yeah, they just made fucking uh, Crusade Maximus <laughs> and like put it the rank 9 on one side so it was like already 6-3 and then just anything to put it to 8k and then they just go Gandor X send game yeah because Gandor <laughs> was a, is a legit good OTK deck it yeah. was in yeah. Japan and I was like oh I can't wait to play it when it comes out here it just didn't that way but you could still oh. do it it was just so much harder yeah one of the few times that fucking up the text on a card is actually beneficial mm -hmm. stopped an FTK yeah um, we then have back to power of elements. A new counter trap has been announced, and its name has changed within the last twenty minutes because it oh. was definitely called something else when I read it before. Uh, Dragon King's Aura. Um, so counter trap: when your opponent activates the effect of a monster on the field, uh, negate the activation. If you do destroy that card, then you can apply the following effect: banish one Trigger monster wave. from your hand, yeah. and if you do, special summon that monster that was destroyed by this effect and sent to the graveyard to your field, but its effects are negated. Uh, so it was called Dragon's Wave a few hours ago, but it was translated by different people. Right. Okay. Uh, yeah. And I had it written as something else again as uh, Draco oh. Aura. So I guess everyone's just Dragon something. Yeah, everyone must um, be dragon translating tra in their own like, way. I activate Dragon. Do we have a? Yes, we do. Never mind. Don't worry. Oh no! Wait, we don't. There's no counter trap, just straight negate with no cost, no nothing. It's just I don't think so. fucking negate. No. There's, there's one that shuffles it back to deck, but there's no cost. There's on it. whatever malfunction or something. Because this this is like straight up just a counter trap that is it is a mon it's specifically monster effect, right? Specifically yeah, monster yeah. effect on field. On yeah. field. As a lot of people said, solemn strike got power crit. Not really, but you know. It doesn't, like, you can't stop inherent summons with it, like you can strike, yeah. but how many of those are pissing about right now? Like, exactly. I guess, um, uh, what's, oh, Griffin, but like. Not inherent, activated. activated. Oh, see, so, yeah, so no, no, not like, barely anything right that now. That activates in hand. Don't yeah, so it can't be, it can't be touched. Jokes. Um, <laughs> Until it tries to negate something. Yes. True. Um, and then but, summon it to your field. Hmm. Does it have to shuffle back into your deck? Um, it doesn't shuffle deck. its costs, so because its effects are negated, it, you can try and activate it. <laughs> okay. Give it a go. But it's, it's an interesting card. I think maybe... Its if... effects are negated? Yeah. yeah it's kind if, of it's it's significantly it's worse. Yeah, yeah. Still like, negated. I can see people citing it. It's a counter, a counter trap. So Certain yeah, like... decks it will just destroy. And yeah. then some decks, yeah, trash. Against Flunder, it's problematic. I mean, if you have map... So it's everything. If you have map, it's kind of fine, right? So it's everything. Does it say special summon it from the graveyard? Yes. Yes. Guess Matt, what? Matt doesn't work. <laughs> oh, yeah, true. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, you don't have to. Yeah, you don't have to do this. Yeah, but you yeah. wouldn't. Then nobody's signing it's it. Then. The you know what I mean? Like, I, I think yeah. if you can't use the whole effect of the card, nobody's going to cite it versus your deck. It's super oppressive that it's a counter trap, though. Like, that yes, is it is. Huge. It is. I think we'll if we see this, it'll be side deck for mirror matches. Yeah. Yeah, that's fair. That makes sense. Yeah. Um, cool though cool cool power creep on kit, uh, counter yeah. yeah um there was a whole bunch of other cards but like we're, we're slowly go running out of time all of power of um yes any, um, any standouts that anybody knows or no i we think we've read them. through yeah. yeah like that but that's, that's the standout yeah, yeah cool um now we move on to oh, some questions we missed, there was a hand trap uh so there was a hand trap that got oh, announced yes. uh tributes everything on the field that activated its effect 
summons is a 1500 but gains 1500 for each monster attributed oh back. i thought it i thought attributed everything that Hold had on. effect negated no, it's no, everything, no, everything that, that is activated it's activated, activated, activated an effect yeah so but, sorry bait what? out plunder it's effect really good. so <laughs> it's, it's, all this so shit. it's, from, a, it's from, a nib that attributes everything that's activated its effect this turn but it's but not it, a quick effect yeah it only activates can... on your turn and then it has an end phase effect right so on yeah. my turn if they activate a bunch of stuff, you can go yep. do the thing, tribute everything that's activated its effect. Yep. Yep. This attack becomes it yes, gains times 1500, 1500 for each thing yep. it tributes. And then what's the end phase effect? Special something? I think, yeah, I think it's special something from hand or something. I swear it's uh, from uh, there. Sorry, sorry, what, yeah, yeah, what, sorry, 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 what attribute is that it? activated its effect? What, yeah. attri what attribute is it? Fire. Fire. No, it can't summon. I think it's a it's, woman. Yeah, wind statue. But... I'm trying right. to see if it's in here. I can't see it. It's okay. We've we've gone through the final. That's cool. Of it. That's cool. I think that's, their name's going to change. It's a weird, a little part. bit of a unique. Yeah. Like people like it's a hand trap, and other people like no, really. it is. It's just yeah, sure. in between. It's a like, slower nib. But yeah. It helps you on your turn. It's a one neck card. You. It summons yeah. itself for free, right? Like you just have to tribute their thing, right? The yeah. Specials. If you have, it's an extend. <laughs> if you can force their entire board off one card, it is a fantastic trade. Yeah, I guess. Um, so we move on to some <coughs> comments and questions from uh, both our uh, videos and our Discord. Um, if you weren't aware, we do have a Discord. Link will be in the description. Feel free to jump in, say hi, ask us any questions, have a chat to the lads in there. Cool bunch of dudes. Get out, Stragoon. Um, our first podcast... <laughs> 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 Shit. <laughs> <laughs> Yard stare. This man just went. Get out, Struggle. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody's summit signing it back. Don't worry. Oh, I will. Anyway, yeah. um, yeah. um, so first question comes from Nicholas Smith. Um, he was the one that commented that the um, bathrooms at that YCS oh. where people were locked in were disgusting. Yes. Um, not surprising. Most hopefully you get then. players are involved are not nice. Um, it's true. From Discord, we have uh, Nico Nui. Oh, oh, right, yeah. Sorry. Um, it's your cousin. Yeah. What's the go with constant delays of product? Has Konami actually spoken <laughs> about it, or is it just assumed to be pandemic re pandemic related? It just feels like it's getting worse. Um, we yeah, kind of touch on it at the start of the podcast, but it does seem as though Konami touches on it a little in the fact that they update their product page and then they send out a message to the distros and say it's your problem. Yeah, and like then, um, Icon does have a product release schedule, yeah. and the amount that schedule is stuck to is horribly low. Oh, there's yeah. even like, even with like sleeves, there's like a Karibo. Sorry, how did I get on the other side of my hand? I was like <laughs> I this, and it landed there. I don't know. Um, even with uh, there's like Karibo sleeves and deck boxes that were meant to that are on their um product page that I saw, and I was like, that'd be kind of funny just to get like a couple of. Can't get them. They came out like oh, three weeks ago. Can't get them. They came um, out ages ago. Yeah, like okay. legit. Like, but I tried to order them and they were like, "Oh, they're delayed." And I went, "But oh, do they not?" No, like when I when I tried to get them at the time, I was like, "Oh, can I order some of these?" Like just bef before they came out, and they were like, "We don't know if we're getting them. They're probably delayed." Oh, I got them on release date. I was like, "I just had them at my shop." I was like, "God oh. damn it!" Um, but yeah, even stuff like that where they just don't know. They don't know when they get it. They don't know, like. Mm. yeah they do that yeah. thing um yeah. i will say it's not a entirely exclusive Yu-Gi-Oh Yu thing pokemon has been hit with delays sometimes like we do okay to get um pokemon like, at least sets. they make a point of their main sets release on time yes but for Yu-Gi-Oh, it's the main sets release on time actually maybe two weeks later yeah maybe <laughs> actually maybe and two I, weeks I, after that <laughs> you know what's funny too i think there's like a weird problem with when they want to bring stuff out because thursday slash friday is a fucking awful day to do it because the moment you miss that window it's coming out next week like oh, yeah. if you just put it at the start of the week even if you're delayed you at least get it the tuesday wednesday thursday at the latest yeah the moment you're doing it before a weekend i know before you comment I know we're one of the only countries that don't do mail on weekends. I fucking know it's okay. We suck. I we get do it. it. Wait, is it time. just us? Yeah, it's pretty much just us. Oh, I it, didn't yes. know that. Everywhere else, you're getting your mail within a day if you order it from oh. Amazon or Prime. Did you and get your mail wait, 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 wait. But, but Harry Potter oh. said no post on Sundays. It's true. It's He's got me there. Post on Saturdays. And also, he lied because there was an owl that delivered ten billion letters down his yes. fucking chimney. Yes, on, on the <laughs> Sunday. So. Uh, 
Um, but yeah, it, it's just the fact of uh, the other thing is I would like them to I would like to see them shipping to us earlier so we have it because Wizards of the Coast and Wizards of the Coast by the way are shit house. Um, we'll, we will get our product a week and a half in advance, like early, and it'll just sit in our storeroom because that's what it's meant to do. Just so, have it there. We're ready. We can do a midnight release if we want to do a midnight release. We can do pre-releases with it. We can do shit. For this is this what you've brought up there is exclusively an Australian problem, and I think it does very much just have something to do with the distro. Yeah, there will be product where we see it two weeks early. Yeah, Bosch. Uh, Bosch. Uh, breakers of. Battles, ah! of <laughs> Battles of Chaos. Battles of Chaos was that. We had it two weeks early. Pop the mic. Yeah, yeah. So there will be times when we do get the product early, but it is simply just our distro. Yep. It's like the distros in this country really suck when it comes to Yu-Gi-Oh! Where it's solely their problem. Like in America, they get every product two weeks early and it's just sitting at stores. Um, but yeah, over here it's just like, oh, it'll it'll get there when it get there. Did we send it to you early? Oh, okay. But like for the rest of it, oh well. Too bad. I, would say, I talked to um somebody. I'm always like half weird about saying people's names on here because I don't know if they want. But uh, strike one, people. Mm -hmm. Um, and he was saying he was like I get an email the day like the d I asked them to ship it, like I email them saying please ship it and they go okay here's the thing and it gets to me the next day, and it's yeah. apparently the way he, he's always run it and has never had a problem. And I was like bro, where is this? I was like, can I just hassle them? Can I Does get this? Does it then stem to like a regional thing? Do they just look Maybe. and go, pat, will and gone? Maybe. I don't know. Uh, I will have to talk to a couple of people about Central and Town Hall and see like when, if they're always on time. But um, again, it seems like an Australian thing. I know in the oh. UK, they never had a problem with it, ever. The other thing um, it could be so. too is um, like independent versus... Um, chain store, chain. company stores. Which yeah, one's yeah. an independent and Good Games all was an independent. Yeah, I suppose, technically speaking, it is. So, like, if, if Central and Good Games and stuff are getting it through Good Games... Uh, good Games are order <coughs> the companies ordering it and then giving it to... That would be a lot, like, better looking for Distro, but... But, yeah. yeah. Hassle them. I don't yeah. care. Quite Probably. annoying. Um, but hopefully, in the coming 12 months, that improves somewhat. Because there's... Realistically, only no. so long you can use this as an this excuse. This is just a Yu-Gi-Oh thing. This is just a you. No, no. Icon, yeah. Icon. We get our Pokemon. We get our Pokemon stuff from the same distro, and it's always on time. Yeah. So it, I don't. I don't know what they're just doing. A thing. I don't know I what they're doing. It's the, the same people. Same boat. It's the same people. All my other product early. You gear shows up. I thought for some reason. Oh, I guess we sometimes go. I thought it was the different for a second, and I was no, like, no, no. it's no. the same. Right. Yeah. We yeah. Move? And I think we with move? um, I'm nearly done. I think with Yu Gi Oh as well, there is selected Sorry. people that actually import it, whereas I feel like with other games there's multiple importers so there might be more yes. avenues to actually get stock yes whereas i think there's maybe two people that actually import bulk Yu-Gi-Oh product into the country i think for pokemon i've got three options um oh for magic i've also got three options oh it, it's saying that for magic our distro is literally paramount like if we don't wow. get it on time jabe just like just drive just go knock on their door like tell them oi let me give give, give product give give, give, See, give product for me it comes in in melbourne gets shipped to Brisbane, then I get it from Brisbane. Sick. So, yeah. Love well. that. Um, but yeah, moving on to the next question from Rickalodeon. Um, <laughs> sad this won't be read by Lachlan, but how... <laughs> <laughs> I knew it. How would you create an updated Dual Devastator product? Uh, many friends have returned Ooh. to the game due to Master Duel and have been... And I've been pointing them that way. Um... Oh, Dupo um, was that Dupo? Is that what I was thinking of? Like, no, hand trap, hand trap, hand trap. Yeah. Yeah. Dude, oh, sorry, do, Honor, yeah. honestly, do the same thing again. Do the, yeah. Just, just reprint all the hand traps, except this time it's been a little longer. You can sneak an evenly matched in. You can sneak an imperm in. The imperm's been in a structure deck at this point. Just put yeah, it in there. Exactly. Just do literally the same thing again. Do it every two to three years and just treat it as market coolant. Just yeah. put out a product that's every hand trap. Some extra deck staples you'll need. You don't need to print the expensive staples. You can print budget options. Oh, the last time the budget options. Really shit. <laughs> like, really? Uh, <laughs> yeah, but this time around, do it. They've been doing a little bit better with um, staple reprints somewhat. Like, hand traps have always been the stick. Um, battle, um, not Battles of Chaos, what was it? Toon Chaos, they reprinted Pot of Greed, Nightmare Phoenix, Nightmare Unicorn. I didn't know we got a Pot of Greed No, no, no. Pot of, uh, no, uh, no, pot of, of Extravagance. Uh, yeah, yeah, okay. There we go, we Fair got there. Gamma. Gamma of Desires, Gamma, 
Um, yeah. Fucking, all is rares? Yeah, all is yeah, rares. Gamma's super rare. cheap. Um, they had um, E-Telly come back as well. Solemn Strike is a rare. Like, they've been getting yeah, better, but it's like they're still missing out on critical cards like Ash Blossom, Ghost Bell, Imperm, Lightning yeah. Storm, Evenly Matched. I shit like that. Storm's probably still in that range where you can't probably reprint that. Oh, that definitely can't be a rare, right? But I, well, they're all ultras, but it's more. I don't think you can guarantee a card like that. You can guarantee. I think at this point, you can guarantee an evenly matched. You Give can droplet. Yeah. yeah. It's funny that we even had the dual devastator product where people were guaranteed an ash blossom, but that card is still ridiculously expensive. It's, it's, they're all twenty US. It, it they're twenty US at, at a floor. first. It worked at first. So at it did. First, it brought it down. That was like eight bucks. I bought my ashes off someone for like yeah five or ten bucks each. Yeah. They like, went up after. It's yeah. always a, ca- a case of the stuff like that will just always go up. Mm. So it needs to just simply be treated as cool. Like if they just reprinted that old dude Levastator in an unlimited print, we would probably still, still like buy it. And like and like yeah. the, the thing is too is that um, again. Secondary market price has absolutely no profit to good games to good games to Konami. <laughs> like like yeah, we do. Um, <laughs> uh, Konami makes no money off the secondary market, so they can do this kind of stuff and do it pretty happily because they know you will absolutely buy a shit ton of that product because there's good cards in it and cool. They don't need to care if if Ash oh, no, costs twenty dollars. A card that we sold five years ago as a secret rare has gone down in price. <clears throat> what a shame, but. <laughs> What I'm what I'm picturing in my head is like if you this is so if you go onto Hearthstone Replay you can see the top ten cards that are most played. We brought up another card game again on the podcast. I know, but but like, it'll, 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 it'll give like you six. it'll give you the popularity of cards. And when I think of Yu Gi Oh, that's what I do. I go, what are the top ten mo- or even fifteen most popular cards that are played? How accessible are they? Are they archetype specific cards? Are they? We do not have functional reprints for any of those cards. We don't. Mm. Like, yes, I, st- I still think you want... Um, Evenly is a really good example. Evenly yeah. is a really good side deck card that is a little. It should be a little bit easier to get. Realistically. It would be sick. In my, in my bedroom, I'm sure most players have this. It's just a binder filled with cards you would put in your side deck. Or mm-hmm. cards that will fill up the, the remaining... back of my binder. Nine cards in your deck once yeah. you've built the 31 cards you intend to revolve it around. Just reprint that. Yep. So whatever's in that in that folder. Og- oh no, it. Ogre just got one. You don't have to put um, in the expensive stuff. Getting another one too. Yeah, it's getting another. So yep. you can do Ash again. You can do maybe a Droll. You can do Ogre again. It yeah. Does it literally doesn't um, matter. Just print all of them. Give Dro- Droll. Well, it, it, it legitimately wouldn't matter if they printed the box again. Like you said, yeah. yeah. Just print them function them exactly now. the same. You get at least eighty percent of the cards that you really want. Mm. Um, the extra then, stuff again was decently shit, but. It's it's interesting by the I way that I don't even um, remember there being extra extra stuff yeah, in there. Yeah, it was like yeah, I Coral forget. Dragon, I think, was the most expensive. Oh, yes. oh yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. It's interesting sure. that Storm and Tactics as reprints have gone down since coming out. Yeah. Like the reprints have, and the hand trap hand traps have done the opposite. So it's simply because like the reprints like that are high, high, high demand when they come out as a reprint. So, like, over time, as more products opened, they will gradually come down a little bit. Mm. Whereas, like, with the hand trap stuff, that is really, really high demand. But everyone's kind of like, it's okay, it's easy to get. And then two months later, all the products been opened, and it's not that easy to get anymore. Mm-hmm. And, yeah, and people, just and people are holding them. Enough, yeah. enough. That's probably half the problem with it as well, that, that, like, amongst the issue of not getting product on time, we don't seem seem to get nearly as much product as we used to say two to three years ago like there used to be a time where you could easily buy a set from a year and a half ago for yeah. the lols because oh, they couldn't be sold absolutely no one was buying it and you'd be like oh there's what a secret the, ash blossom what, in here the... i remember actually fucking working and you told me oh um good games wollongong has 10 packs of maximum crisis you should go buy them oh, good game. it was fig tree eb fig tree eb yeah I went there, I bought them, I pulled an ash. Hell yeah, that's a yeah. And this was what yeah. three it would have been like two years to three years the, after yeah. the set released and they just yeah. had Max Crisis sitting yeah. there. Like that doesn't happen anymore. Yeah. Once a set is like gone past a month and a half of release, it is scarce yeah. as fuck, if it, not it, it, impossible to find. Part of that is the COVID kinda lockdown boom of people buying product just to sit on. Like I just 
randomly have a customer at work now that I've never seen before that just pre-orders every Yu-Gi-Oh set. Yes. And I've never seen him play cards before, and he's like, I'm just going to put this under my bed. And it's uh, like, okay. I also have done this. Yeah. That's, I did it with Pokemon, and people are doing it with Pokemon out the ass. Cause... I think Pokemon's the better game to do it with. Um, but there's still there's still a lot of money to be made for like um, Toon Chaos and stuff like this went yeah. crazy so well, yes. Toon Chaos sold out yes true Toon Chaos like it was only available for about a week also um, Toon Chaos first ed I've, it's been killing my brain you'll probably remember so uh, this is not the set we're talking about the reprint set that's not the Kaiba one right that also no, had no. all the hand traps no, in it no 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 because so that was before that and this, it's both sold this was a, yes. a box it was a box <laughs> you paid this was a point I was going to bring up because um, I so think I bought I think I bought a set of all of those the the, yeah. the dual Devastator yeah 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 so, I think I, that's when I got back into the game because I bought a set of all of the in Australia much like every product we got fucked so it was $40 <laughs> USD $80 Australian oh ew. and that kind of was the thing that killed it a bit in Australia of like you could have bought it at like 60 Australian and you would have made a profit if you sold the singles at 80 nah <laughs> yeah and that kind of killed it a bit but it was essentially an 80 dollar MSRP box that you just opened and it had 60 cards in it they were the same cards in every box and you got everything okay it was because essentially one of everything because of everything. Kyber's Kyber's was still a set it was just a set it was like a very small set that came with like small set reprint of old and staple cards yeah and it was like Ash Ogre Valar it was like fucking everything yeah. and they were like it wasn't short printed it was short it was incredibly short printed but um, but you can do those sets all day you yeah. can do those sets all day yeah keep going it's fine um, but yeah I would again I'd like to see droplets I'd like to see droplets again um has it got an it was an ultra or no brothers of legend was another secret right? another secret yeah um i give think it it's a, getting done in the tins the mega tins yes yes, yes it, it is it, it is it is we don't know what rarity i'm open prosperity Lower? are we talking ash blossom no, no uh, drop, a, drop a letter I, drop a letter mega tins should also have dm support yeah baby let's go ash blossom was never in the mega tin so it shouldn't be in the mega tin mega reprint yes um also prosperity question mark that would be well, sick, but yeah, is it be early enough? Chill out. Yeah, yeah. It's, 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 it'll be this mega tin. Bro, it was yeah. blazing right, vortex, so. right? It'll either be in this mega tin or it'll be in whatever Look, our like our Toon members, Chaos of the Year. It's a hundred yeah. bucks still, so in my head I'm like, oh, yeah. what? Card exp- drop, of, drop a letter. No, pros, 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 pros. Is this a fucking 180? Oh, there you go. Even yeah, more. It's a hundred. It my brain so if a card much. goes over a hundred, I'm like, well, a hundred dollar card. Bro, it's a, it's, it, I saw a set sell for like I don't I even want to like say the like five twenty the other day, and I was it's like, "So expensive for a car that I just don't." Think it's is not worth that. It. Yeah, it's not like Pot of Desires when it was a hundred. I was like, "Yup, yeah." Card good. Card says draw two. Draw two. Pot of Dick fuckery is like, "Hey, you will not kill your <laughs> opponent this turn. Also, you'll probably get the card you want, but if you don't, you're gonna be very sad. You're gonna be so <laughs> fucking sad. You are, and Dude, your opponent. You know, if you flip yeah, you six, know and you go, six and you, you go, you go, we're bird. Yeah. <laughs> so now I flipped six, and it was like, uh, I needed to see a monster. Hmm. I saw uh, hospitality, small world, uh, tidying, small world. <laughs> Prosperity, small world. <laughs> I feel like, like you're playing fucking Digimon. At that it's a small world. At that point, world I was like, after well, all. I've got Nibiru in my hand. Yes, I had small world. Oh, and this is the point where you're like, oh, the only target I have is the other. <laughs> no, no, no. This, was, this is a different point. Um, but, like, uh, I, I also think those sets are a way to um, functionally get new players into the game because it's a really good pipeline for getting new players to get slightly stronger cards to then get them to slightly more into the idea of spending money on the game and then the issue was still that in a sh- in, in other countries apparently it's amazing for that in australia that 80 dollars because you have to look at someone dead in the eyes and go 240 dollars you can make the other stuff you've bought competitive that's yeah. a lot to ask for someone yes, getting is. into a card game. Yes, absolutely. That's true. You is definitely so it is a the high ceiling. most expensive Ultimately, card Ultimately, just an entry-level meta. Yeah. I guess to summarize it, do pretty much the same <laughs> thing again. Put, just maybe work the past yeah, a little bit. Yeah, put a couple of extra good stuff into it and maybe translate the price accurately. But don't like, forget, there's heaps of budget fucking options for hand traps, like Effect Valor. We'll see like if they do that kind of set again, it'll be like 
forbidden chalice. <laughs> True. But I think I think there are busted enough cards right now, evenly dark ruler shit like this that you can put like they're just great they will always I think they will always be good because they are yeah. so strong so if he's mm-hmm. at 3 now people need 3 really honestly maybe. people should just play it it's not bad yeah, yeah. going it's second one reprint that I guess had a little devastated one that I always loved was Silent Graveyard like oh yeah oh, that's a, a great cool card, card. Yeah, that's it's a great cool card. card good rarity bump yeah. sick mm. they like, then turn off put it in an OTS pack two minutes later because they need to change it from Forbidden Graveyard to Silent Graveyard so that it wasn't searchable. Yep. Oh, <laughs> right. Because they printed the new card that was just add a forbidden card. Okay. <laughs> Great. So you can search drop one now. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. Oh, because it's that's thanks. I hate it. Yeah. yeah. Uh, last question we have is from Ragai. When are you guys gonna get Konami to send you stuff to open? Please. Wow. Listen, How if, if oh, we yeah. can't get distributor stuff, so, this ain't happening. <laughs> yeah. The most I am um, functionally able to do is ask very nicely that if we get stuff early, like um, Battle of Chaos. We got that early. That if we good. get it early, I can ask to do like an in-store, I leave the product in the store, but we get to open it and show you guys and we can put that on the channel. That'd be cool. But that's provided distro get it to us before the release date you've seen 40 other fucking youtubers open it already because they're in the us and they got it four and a half weeks early and their grandmother has the fucking product before we do so listen it'd be cool but i, I want to be sent free stuff to open yeah. i do too i did once bring this up with uh a kanami rep at something i don't know what it was uh they uh yeah it was at a uh, regional i spoke to one of the guys that works for kanami i guess um they don't do it and try Oh, they just, of course. It's, it's just so not right. a program that they do here I, d- I don't know why they would <sighs> I, I remember when they did one thing they'd be really mad it was like they were releasing a set and each YouTuber got like five cards from the set to reveal and there was one dude that had like 200 subs and they gave him five cards and I was like fuck you <laughs> come yeah, on that's, yeah. that's like, so fuck you. Yeah. I think um I, again oh, I mean that kind of stuff is fucked. That's stupid as shit. That's so. I will dumb. say with like the actual products and stuff, it's like oh okay I understand. Like if you're in Europe or US, it's like super controlled environment. You can send them exactly what you want. Here it's like they just can't be fucked. They're yeah. just like oh we don't want to deal with it's, it. Then like, it's an, it's just not worth them importing and then sending out. They can just send it to someone in Europe who gets the same audio. Also like over here, it, there's not really that many big Australian YouTubers. Like I'm willing to say that I'm second at Lazarus third. Really? Yeah, probably. Because yeah. I know shit. first place is like 9k, and he doesn't get it? any views anymore. Who is it? Uh, I don't know the name. I know it's got Wolf in it. That's all I know. Oh, okay. I'm sure I watched oh, damn. it. But... Let's go. Well, like, all my audience is America, and then Germany. I'm like, what? <laughs> yeah. You guys, I know my audience you guys when I started, that I went to of... Portugal. I was yeah. Like, yeah. America, Shout out Germany. Shout 37 yeah. Wolf. He is in Perth. What a kid. Oh, no, he's, he's doing okay. Oh, he's doing good recently. A couple thousand. There, there was a bit where he dried up quite a lot. His uh, most viewed video was massive, though, if you check it out. Oh, yeah? Uh, it's how to install Yu Gi Oh! Pro or something like that. How to, it's just bro, bro, how to download Yu Gi Oh! Pro yeah. 2 in 129,000 views. I get asked yeah. so often what sim I'm playing on, and I use all the sims in my videos. Should and make like, a how to install video. Bro, People actually do it. Actually do it. fucking know oh, yeah. Yu Gi Oh! sims, and I'm yeah. like, how do you play without knowing all the sims? How to install Master Duel. How to install Throw Ego money Pro. at Konami. How to install uh, his Steam Dueling Book. How to use Google my credit Google. card on Master Duel. And, and his yeah. second most viewed video is YGO Pro 2 No Pictures Fixing 77,000. This, wow. yeah. Dude, he how, hit, we've he been doing it wrong, yeah. man. We just gotta make how to install YGO Pro. Bro, uh, four of his five top videos time. is YGO Pro installation hey, shit. Top I know Yu Gi Oh players are brain dead, however. <laughs> I didn't think it was this bad. I won't lie to you. Even like, uh, I was installing a game the other day, and I looked it up, and this dude has like a hundred subs, and he's like, "Hi guys, welcome!" To-. And I was like, "God damn it!" The, the video has a like fucking two hundred thousand views. So I was like, "Yeah, right. I'm stupid. He's stupid." All right, fair enough. Uh, but that concludes us for tonight. Thank you stupid. very much for watching. As I said, feel free to jump in our Discord, like, subscribe, um, hit us with some questions for next week, and we'll see you then. Bye. Konami, send us stuff. Yeah, please.